So, Vanderwall finally agreed to cooperate? Yep. Said he could give us a head start on the Mindjacker. We'd better not keep the man waiting, then. And also, why do I have to steal the fucking external hard drive? I mean, what am I getting in exchange with these very strange people that gave me the data package? It's very, very odd. I'm gonna save. Hey, Max. What's up? Mmm, transit station. How are you holding up? I'm okay. A little hungry. I meant about what happened at the station. I think you did the hard work on that one. Don't let it go to your head, though. Oh, you're so happy. I, I love Lao. She's so cool, and she's like a badass techno sniper. Techno sniper. That's a good band name. That bomber. He was American, wasn't he? He certainly had the accent. Sounded Texan. Did you know him? Dr. Lao. Texas is an enormous place. I do not happen to know every single other person who lived there. And besides, I left well before he would have been born. Do you ever regret doing that? Not for a second. Especially after seeing how it's gotten now. So where are we in the world? Because she mentioned Eurofed and America. Are we in, like, Africa or Australia or something? There's more to what was between you and that kid, wasn't there? Like you said, you never met him before, but it seemed personal to you. You're very perceptive, Dr. Lau. It's useful for an investigator. You want me to stop asking? <sighs> There's a reason that kids like him and hundreds others exist. It's not because the seditionists thought that weaponizing the human body was the biggest innovation since air power, but the engineers that got to make these kids, for whatever reason, didn't say no. Regis, I... You could say I knew him too well, inside and out. That is what bothers me. Wow, you must have had a very interesting career. Like, we're working with the disabled, but working with disabled people that also are walking bombs. Any luck with the Mindjacker's airship? Still nothing. Like I said, it just vanished. And Central still claims there wasn't anything there at all. But we saw it, Regis. I know! Exactly. Something's not right. I think Central is being tampered with. I wonder if Central's hiding something. Why do you hate Central, Charlie? What? I don't hate Central. You're always arguing with it. I've seen you sabotage more cameras than anyone. It does so much for Newton. The city runs like a well-oiled machine. Maybe, but I think it's working in inappropriate areas. What would count as inappropriate for a city coordinator? Like this. Fundamentally, policing is a human matter. Machines and synthetics don't commit crimes. I don't expect them to be able to understand how perpetrators think and act. So, you're old-fashioned. You'd rather not talk about it. Maybe later? Maybe later, yeah. But still, you still need a human touch on this. The humans can be pretty surprising at times, and they do unexpected shit. I mean, Central was okay with killing the Mindjacker. Not the Mindjacker, the bomber. But I knew I could convince him. I goddamn knew it! Keep at it, Max. Can do, Regis. Can do, Regis. I don't get the appeal of this Cubis stuff. Looks more like abstract impressionism to me. A classic piece by Chandler, if I'm not mistaken. You know, that's a lot less impressive when you can call up a search inside your head. Yeah, you can't just Google that shit instantly and pretend like you knew it, Dr. Lau. I don't get it either, though. It's... I like the floating bit. I wish I could stuck myself in there and start floating. The dock in the wall where the autonomous vacuum cleaner gets its powers... Gets its powers? Gets its power <laughs> and offloads its waste. There is a notice above it. The management thanks you for allowing the sanitation machinery and staff to continue their work by not obstructing the docks. These stations are for the use of custodial equipment only. Okay, can I tamper with it? Can I shoot it? That's not going to fit into the charging dock. Are you sure? Can I shoot this little guy? Hey, Charlie! Go and punch your food machine at home if you really feel like some Luddism. Hmm, I get the feeling that you're important somehow. Nah, my apartment building's already got one. That's pretty cool. So the apartment building cleans itself and maybe cleans the apartments too? Well, I've been putting it off for quite a long time. Let's talk to this guy. Vanderwall, you there? You sure he's in? He told us to meet him here. Central hasn't logged any departures from this floor since this morning either. Okay, he... <gasps> he's probably dead. We haven't got time for this, Gil. I don't think he's answering. Lau, can you do your door magic or something? 
Hey, Max. What's up? The door. You've got a brain for wetware systems, right? Don't you mean full of wetware systems? Huh. <laughs> this isn't just me being offensive. Can you have a word with the door controls? I'll see what I can do. Have a word with the door. That's cute. Got it. I reset the password. It's now password one. I'm just glad you're on our side now. Damn straight. I could probably make a lot more money if I turned to crime. I don't really want to think about it because you're probably uh, spot on. I wonder if you could have solved this through a very clever puzzle, but Lao just has this in a bag. It's, she's good at everything. Oh, hello. Gail, you in here? Oh, excuse us, miss. I'm Dr. Regis. This is Dr. She Lau. doesn't look right. We're cell agents. Miss, are you alright? Get down. Get down now. Regis, this is a synth. <laughs> the look on your face is priceless. It's a very expensive one, but it's still a synth. And apparently out of charge. Something else about it bothers me more. I know. I sure hope that isn't blood. Ooh, so the robot killed its master. I knew Hello? he'd be dead. Hmm, I think I know what's wrong with it. Can we take her to the vacuum cleaner's port, or this one? This looks like a port, so she can recharge. Come on! Hmm. Hi, I'm Shep! No! What can I get for you? I thought you died. What's on the menu? If you're feeling peckish, I could whip up some frilled eggs and white wine sauce. Or how about some nice caramel orange? Sounds better than what mine can do. Or if you want some of Mr. Gill's favorite, I can always make toaster pastries! Wow, that's a lot better than what... Tatha? What was her name? Tat... Well, I know Mandela was her avatar, but wow, she got, like, really the lowest of the lowest of grades of food with the sur protein surprise and sucro gelatin. What are you? I'm Sheppy, your friendly food helper! Alright, what's this machine you come in? This masterpiece is the THE Food Hormone Range Comestible Synthesizer! It's the best thing since sliced bread, which it even made! Sounds like it's trying too hard to be helpful. I love helping! Helping is fun! So yeah, if you um, are rich, basically you get a better food machine. Which I guess makes sense. Although, it sucks. What's the difference between you and the one I've got at home? The J115. Oh, I'm much newer! My dynamic protein stereo lithography system means I can make nearly anything! I've got so much more flavor treatment! I can make just about any taste you desire! What if I wanted some of that protein slop that mine makes? Ugh, I'm sorry, I can't do that. But how about some truffles? It's a snob, then. So, oh yeah, so Dr. Regis lives in a, an apartment that Tatha lived in. I hope that's her name. Yeah, because he's paying for the really expensive mini garden. How much did you set the Vanderwalls back, then? I'm only 410,000 quantas oh. of all good retailers. That's more than I make in a year. These people can apparently afford the finer things. Must be nice. Can you make... Can you make Texas gumbo? Oh, of course. Looking for a taste of home? I've never found anywhere here that can do good gumbo. Can you make... Can you make chicken hacienda? Oh, of course. How? I just made it up. I can extrapolate what it involves based on your request, tone of voice, and dietary habits. Sounds like it's more and more worth its price. Yeah, can I, like, get one in my house? It might be never relevant, mind. though. You know, I wonder if there was a puzzle to opening the door. Because it's very easy to get Lao to do all the opening for you, and I don't really like missing any of the puzzles. Is this refrigerator locked? Who the hell locks a refrigerator? Maybe they've got really expensive tastes? Although, they've got the food machine as well. Perhaps they've got something else in there. Aha! Uh -huh. Shoot it down. Shoot the fridge. That's not going to get it open. What are you talking about? It's a gun! Seriously? The large refrigerator has a combination lock built into the door. Well, they're storing corpses, probably. Can I mess with the maid? Do you think I can recharge the synth with my stunner? Pray not. 
There's a layer of fake skin in the way. Depending on where you did it, you'd probably just burn out the more delicate systems. Okay, can you do it? Hey, Max. What's up? Why do you think someone would lock their refrigerator? Same reason you'd lock anything else. Something valuable inside it. But what? Some people keep wetware at low temperatures to stop GGs. And GGs are? Oh, gray goo. Catastrophic exponential reproduction. Under certain conditions, the fabricators and the wetware make more of themselves. And low temperatures prevent that? Not really, but higher temperatures definitely accelerate the growth. People like to think they're in control, though. Any idea what's wrong with the maid? I couldn't even get a return signal out of it. My guess would be that it's run out of power. Any way we can fix that? It's supposed to charge itself, but apparently it hasn't managed to do that. How? We can't haul that thing to a socket. Hmm. We'll have to charge the power cell itself. In a platform like that, the cell's usually in the upper torso, about where the heart would be. You reckon that'd be easier to charge? It's only about as big as your fist. Just have to get it out of her. So I'm gonna touch some robot boobies. Okay. Keep at it, Max. Can do, Regis. I need to get the power cell that Mimis has made. Hello? Hmm, I think I know- How- how do I get it? Doesn't let me touch the boobies. Another example of questionable art hangs from the ceiling. I kinda like this one. Um, okay, so it's biometrically locked. And the password, so that I can't- I can't. Our special place. Well, I don't know your special place. Connect call. Who can I call? I don't know who to call. Howdy, partner. What can I get y'all? Ooh. Vodka. On the rocks. Twist of lime. Regis? Fine. Make it two. <laughs> Fine. Make it two. What do you do here, then? Why? Well, I'm the bartender. I fix up drinks for the fine folk who live here. Anything else? Anything else? Heck, drinks is a whole lot of stuff to know. Why, I'm the foremost expert on fine drinking in these here parts. So, if anyone wanted to know what to put into a drink... They'd come to me, sure as shooting. There's been a bit of an incident. You don't happen to have seen what went on. Hey, mister. I don't just go blabbing my customer's secrets like that. He's bluffing. He never saw anything. You're just bitter you never left that wall. Hey, it's a fine job I have here. I ain't seen nothing since Mr. Vanderwall got his wine out of the rack this evening. So he got some wine. I'll speak to you. I'll keep your tab open. Alrighty, partner. I'm still kind of wary of this robot maid covered in blood. I can see a body. Jesus oh, Christ. Well, I can see multiple parts what of a body. What the hell happened in here? Did someone get to Vanderwall before he could talk? Maybe it's a domestic gone bad? The blackmailer said nothing about this. Possibly didn't even expect this themselves. Still, you need to find what they demanded before the whole apartment is picked apart by for forensic drones. Wow. We should check around first. What? We need to get a look at it ourselves, before the crime scene people wreck it. That's true. I'm not sure. Absolutely not. Okay. Good idea. Really? Well, yes. Who are you and what have you done with Charlie Regis? What do you mean? You're unusually cavalier today. You got something on your mind? I mean, I know you don't usually care what Central thinks about regulations, but... It would help us. It's the right thing to do. It would help us. And also my unborn embryo petri dish babies. This time I think it could help us get a lead on our investigation. Besides, all the time we waste, the Mindjacker may have found their next victim. I like this, Regis. I Let's like him too. And I like you, Lau. You feel glad that Max suggested it and not you. Now you have the free reign you need to find that device the voice wanted. But what are they gonna give me in, in return? Hmm, I need to take care of my babies. Picked up photograph. Does it have the special place? Paris. Maybe. A photograph of two men, a younger Giel and Dakarai Vanderwall, by an urban river. In the ground in the background, the Eiffel Tower is dwarfed by looming glass sky skyscrapers. The back of the photograph has a note written by hand. The wedding, August 2071. Maybe that's the combination for the for the fridge. 2071. You know, I haven't talked to the Central in quite a while. 
This is Regis. Come in, Central. Central, standing by. The situation's changed. Background. I don't really want to tell Central just about yet about what happened. What do we know about Gil van der Waal? Born in Pretoria in the Federation of Southern African State, married to Dakari van der Waal, former Olympic athlete. How long's he been in Newton? Immigration, March 2068. Awarded residence due to outstanding personal contributions to art and culture. Despite his shady history? No accusations have been made of connections to organized crime. Attempts at prosecution within the FSAS have all proven unsuccessful, as his social activity index has remained above 50. No further investigation has been taken by Sam. Interesting, so every person has a social index. It reminds me of another uh, adventure game called Culpa Inara, I think, where every every citizen had this kind of index, and you lived better by how high your index was. What do we know about Vanderwall's connection to the Mindjacker? Subject, Gail Vanderwall. Before immigration from the Southern African Federation, Vanderwall was known to possess a number of links to organized crime. And yet we still let him into the country. He possessed a reputation as a fixer, arranging specialized talent for criminal organizations. And for hacking the human brain, you need some pretty niche talent and hardware. The kind of people that Vanderwall would have had connections to in his history. He had been placed on sales watch list, but then he made a most surprising move. He came to us. Doesn't that pretty much confirm his involvement? It merely confirms his awareness, not necessarily his complicity. Well, it doesn't matter now. He's, like, been torn to shreds by his maid. <gasps> Maybe his maid was hacked. Regis out. I'm gonna tell her later. And I can't seem to input a code in this refrigerator, even though it tells me it has a code. Anywho, it's time to puzzle him back. Look at all the bit bits and pieces. Standing out from the festival of gore is a human hand. It appears to be fairly intact. Okay, I can pick up his organs. Lovely. Gil Vanderwall's cold, dead hand. Okay, are we really gonna pu puzzle him back together? That's strange. I think I'm carrying as much of Vanderwall around as I want to. I probably shouldn't have disturbed, disturbed the crime scene by taking his hand. Hmm. I think I'm carrying. It's like they had an industrial accident. In the bedroom? Well, it happens. It's like they in the body. Jacuzzi. A jacuzzi sits in the corner of the room. You wonder what kind of man needs to have a pool quite so, quite so readily available at all times. There's something at the bottom of the pool. A pistol? A murder weapon? One of them, maybe. It's too deep to reach. Not without severely contaminating the crime scene, anyway. Oh, no, it's fine. I already took something of his. I think we've contaminated it enough. I have no idea who that's supposed to be. Shall I trance it for you? There's no such thing as comfortable ignorance anymore, is there? Huh? You old people are weird. Yeah, you can just Google that. I don't think I can justify taking that. Okay, fair enough. There's a 25 on the bed, or maybe it's just ornamental. The pad appears to control the floor-mounted wardrobe. The panel seems to be showing an error message. Okay. Why? Oh, the- Oh, it's probably underneath the bed. <clears throat> Mechanical error. Please ensure that there are no obstructions to opening your THE system's floor drobe. So what's obstructing it? Coat hanger. Oh, fair enough. After a couple of tugs, the hanger came loose. I got the hanger. Lovely. I'm getting all sorts of things that disturb the crime scene. Hey. Hey, Lau. Hey, Lau. Need a hand? <laughs> That's horrible. Okay, let's try it again. See anything interesting? There's an empty gun rack in here. Ammunition, maintenance tools, cleaning spray, but no gun. In their closet? Maybe it's their outdoor gear. There's fishing equipment in here as well. Are you taking stuff again? 
It might be useful. Call it a hunch. That's it? I wanted to explore the whole thing. Oh, fair enough. Well, the gun is probably in here. Can I pick it up with... Oh, I'm gonna make an in interesting combination here. There we go. Now it's got an enormous hook. Do you, do you want to place the hand on it as well? That won't make good bait. Are you sure? <laughs> let's, let's go fishing. Nothing biting? The hook sinks, but I can't catch that pistol at the bottom. So what do I need? I've already got a hook. Come on, use the hand. Give it a hand. That wouldn't make very good bait. What would, though? The photo? I need another thing for bait. I can just about make out a pistol. Careful how you get it out, though. You're the one who's always lecturing me about contaminating crime scenes with DNA, after all. Are you kidding? You guys aren't even wearing gloves. You've touched like 50 things in this house already. I think this crime scene is pretty much fucked. And this is where we use the hand. He's given us a hand. Lovely. It's definitely his hand, but the system won't recognize it. Interesting. Why? Under whom is it registered? I wonder. They've got a refined taste in wines, I imagine. Actually, no. They're all either a couple of years old or fabricated. Weird. Maybe they're doing something to the wine. Like what? Well, say they were also adding amphetamines to it, for example. If they accidentally ruined it, it'd be better if it was a cheaper wine. Ooh, so maybe there's drugs in here. It'd take a long time to get through all of that. Hmm. They've got a refined... Like what? Well, if they... I wonder if I can do anything with it. Fish it. That won't make good bait. Why do I need bait? Oh. Can you give us a hand again? He... Can't use that anymore. Okay. So I have the password, but I have the wrong hand. Interesting that this hand doesn't work. struck me as much of an art lover. I'm not so keen on this kind of thing. The mag coil keeping it floating, however. Aha! Picked up mag coil. Well, I'll definitely be needing this, and I think it's used here. There. A magnet at the end of a fishing line. Lovely. For catching submarines? Uh, obviously. Regis, this is a synth. Huh, <laughs> the look on your face is priceless. It's a very expensive one, but it's still a synth. And apparently out of charge. Something else about it bothers me more. I know. I sure hope that isn't blood. Hello? Hmm, I think I know what's wrong with it. That's a very expensive synth they've got for a house girl. Jealous? She's not my type. What do you think they use her for? They may be married, but I wouldn't put it past them using her for other things than cleaning. There's a product marker on its back. SNS Synthetics. They're not showing up on a net search. Maybe Vanderwall has more info on his terminal? Good idea. We can see if we can get their help in extracting more from this machine. See? I'm not just a pretty face. Did I get that message last time? I must have, like, completely grazed over it. So I need to contact these SN S Synthetics guys. Yeah, and I just need to do the rest of the stuff I did before because I reloaded the game. I thought it was a bug that I wasn't finding anything. Got it. The murder weapon? One of them, anyway. Why is it in the jacuzzi, though? What we really need is a witness. So I'm facing two problems now. Well, three. I can't access the terminal. I don't know where to look for stuff so I can Google SNS Synthetics or whatever. And I have to break the maid open so I can get her power cell somehow. But how? What do you think happened? The marks on the gun suggest Vanderwall shot his husband. 
and the walls, and the windows, the bed, the door, the pictures. Maybe a domestic dispute? We don't really know how things were here. He wasted a lot of shots. Do you think he missed all those times? Or he was shooting at something else and happened to hit Dakari. The cupboards containing the kitchen's various tools. You wonder for a moment whether the van der walls are extravagant enough to have paid for real organic wood on the doors. I've encountered in most futuristic adventure games that they all refer, they refer to it as, is it synthetic wood or real wood? Anything in here? I've kind of run out of options. Ah, oh, of course. Aside from the pipes running to the food machine, the cabinet contains a set of knives and a tube of co cooking gel. A cooking gel? And a- aw. Oh. Man, I must have gone through every area without checking a fucking cupboard. So what do we have? A knife. A kitchen knife. One of a set. This sort of blade takes me back to my days in medical school. Lovely. This exothermic wetware gel is used for food preparation. The gel cooks food that it's mixed with, releasing chemical energy as heat at a desired temperature while it breaks down. I see Sheffy made it on. Temperature control. Oh. Oh, that's cool. So that's... that's pretty cold, but I wanted to... Okay, that's pretty hot. Maybe... I, I think we have to use this, use this on the hand, because the hand is... Well, the terminal doesn't consider it to be alive, so it needs to be warm. Do I have to consider the body warmth of a human? I think that would be about 36, 37 degrees, maybe? Okay, I hope that's correct. Um, close that. I can use the knife on the maid, right? What are you up to? Just doing some surgery. Picked up power cell. Lovely. Oh. Nice. Uh, and I know that the dock is... We're just gonna plug it in the vacuum uh, cleaner recharge station. Easy peasy. Even though I missed the fucking cupboard. After a few moments of contact, the gauge on the side of the cell fills. A few moments of contact? Man, that's like... Re battery recharge heaven. I'm just gonna check with the terminal first before I uh, activate the maid again. So we put the thermo cooking gel on the hand. Hopefully it's the right temperature. You cover the hand in the thermal gel and it becomes noticeably warmer. Hopefully warm enough. But not too warm. Aha! Biometric security details completed. Wow, that's a lot of contacts. Al's Body Shop. Okay, wow. Darakai's Traveler. I'm gonna... I'm probably not gonna contact everyone here, because he has a lot of contacts. Hi, you reached Zalman Nosos. Oh, and if this is Natalie, please stop calling me. Oh my god. I was just about to do it. I really thought that no one cared. Thank you. Sorry, wrong number. <laughs> he probably shouldn't say that, considering that he was about to kill himself. Hey, maybe calling everyone in the list is a good idea. I, I think I saved a life. You're welcome, Yari. Almost nobody's answering. The kind of people on the list, they're probably all busy. That's the president of Federal Europe you just tried to call. Oh, well, she's probably busy. What's your name? Sorry, wrong number. Yep, that's my name. Sorry, wrong number. It's it's foreign. Welcome to Toll of a Training. Making your butler snooty is our duty. How can I help you? It's about time you phoned. So do you want these bootleg Blackwell games or not? <laughs> no, thank you. <laughs> bootleg Blackwell games. If you don't know what the Blackwell games are, they're they're a very, very popular series, also by Watch It I, I Games. 
ter incredibly good adventure games. I recommend you play them, but not bootleg versions. Hi, this is Salome Bestra. I'm not here right now, but I'll get back to you as soon as possible. And if this is Natalie, please stop bothering Salmon. Who's this Natalie person I keep hearing about? I want to talk to her. I know that I have to call SNS Synthetics to progress the game, but I want to <laughs> I want to see all the Easter eggs on this list. This is the Psychic University. We know, <laughs> we why, know why you called. The answer is yes. Three o'clock next Wednesday. You don't need to leave a message. We know who you are. Fair enough. We we have an appointment. Hello. Is this Solomon? God, I've been trying to call you for weeks. Why haven't you answered me? Sorry. Wrong number. <laughs> I wish you would respond back. Oh, this was the Natalie that's, uh, that's bothering everyone. Can I call her again? Hello? Is this... Sorry. Sorry. Wrong number. I think we'd better save that call for after we understand what's going on. Mm-hmm. Legitimate Johnson. Hello, you have reached the offices of Legitimate Johnson, Nigerian <laughs> Prince. Please leave your name, number, and social security after the beep. <laughs> and bank details, if you want. <laughs> That's brilliant. Nina John. Found someone you know? I... probably not. I think it's just a coincidence. And even if it was her, I don't think I ever want to hear from her again. I wonder who she is. Maybe she's like a a part of the cast that made the game or something? Interesting. Maybe she's one of the voice actresses. I should look that up. Jazz hands. Ooh. You've reached Jazz hands. Jazz or size. No thanks. This is the French Embassy. Opening hours. Uh, Tuesday, 10 a.m. until 10.15 a.m. <laughs> They're open for 15 minutes? Hello, Beetle? Jesus, Beetle, where have you been? Did you get the job done? Is Luca slimming with the fishes? Is Jimmy the Squirrel getting fitted for his cement shoes? Did you pick up my dry cleaning? Well, come on, you moron, say something! Oh, it, yeah, the business is done. Dominic, man. <laughs> I love these little Easter eggs. Whoa. Sorry, wrong number. <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> that was terrifying. Dragon. If you need to buy some stuff, meet me at 12 a.m. on 38 of under. Sorry, wrong number. <laughs> if you need to buy some stuff. I got this cool stuff, man. Hey, Lau. Reckon the building's repair staff can deal with the synth maid? I guess no. They're here for pipes and appliances. Damn. Better think of something else. It's okay. We I've already got the battery. I'm just uh, going through the list because I like to explore everything. I better not call the cleaners. Crime scene's already pretty contaminated. Yeah, with you licking and ch touching everything. What? Cleaners? Oh my god, he had, like, assassins on speed dial? What the hell? Cell agents, interesting. Good evening, Dr. Regis. Uh, hi? Surely there are better means of checking in than breaking into a suspect's terminal. It's not like we need a warrant for it. No, but your traveler is more secure. Central out. You okay? I... I don't really want to tell Central, though, what, what's going on here, yet. This is Caleb Brown. Uh, I swear to God I have the money for you on Tuesday. Uh, just leave a message and uh, tell me where to drop it. You better get my money, man. Where's my money? Thanks for calling Blackmail R.O. <laughs> don't ask us how we get it, and we won't ask you why you need it. How can I help you? Sorry. Wrong number. Al's Body Shop. Now this was the one I wanted to get to. Hey, this is Al's Body Shop. We've been shut down. So, uh, if, uh, we got your stuff, uh, we'll 
try to get to you, but who knows? This is the cops. You can kiss. My <laughs> Ooh, Al, you've got quite the attitude. Okay, actually, I shouldn't have. Ugh. I wanted to call the SS Synthetics guy. Guys, here we go. The most important call of all. Stepford and Son, Synthetic Associates. Liam Stepford speaking. Ah, oh, Mr. Vanderwall. I trust everything is satisfactory. Mr. Stepford, my name is Dr. Charles Regis. I'm a cell agent. Oh my, yes. How may I help, Dr. Regis? I'm investigating the death of one of your clients, Gil Vanderwall. Oh my, yes. That sounds terrible. We've got your company's name linked to the synthetic in the apartment. Oh my, yes. A repurposed IL-240 platform running a BN-110-187 update cycle. A maid, yes. And a very expensive one it was too, yes. That looks like the one. Oh my, yes. He purchased a complete body. Though it looks like he had some afterwork done on it elsewhere, oh yes. What kind of afterwork? It looks like the personality was tooled elsewhere, yes. Likely to more particular tastes, yes. Not something you'd do? Mr. Regis, this is a family business, oh yes? We simply sell platforms. We cannot be held responsible for alterations thereafter. What can you tell me about this sin? Everything up until its point of sale, oh my, yes. We've recently acquired a number of IL-240 platforms, formerly industrial models. With some cosmetic retooling, they're fit for a great many humanoid roles, oh my yes. Like housework? Oh my yes! Like this platform, we sell many without including a personality. There are a great many legal and ethical restrictions on the sale of AIs within Newton. But if one were to acquire an AI mind state from elsewhere and incorporate it, it leaves you completely blame-free for whatever's done with it. Quite so, Dr. Regis. Oh my, yes. What if they got this AI and put this kind of personality that likes to murder people? And then it powered itself down because it wanted to evade the police. The synth in question is powered down. We need to ask it some questions. It shall need to be revitalized then, oh my yes. Oh my yes. Likely it misgaged its own consumption rate, was unable to reach a charging point. Is there any way to fix it? Oh my yes, you can remove the power cell from the upper torso. It will be concealed by the pseudoderma layer of outer skin, but this can be removed with a sharp implement. So, I have to perform surgery. You will need to remove the power cell and charge it to the platform should return to- That's all I need to know for now. Please don't hesitate to get in contact if you think we can help, oh my, yes. Oh my, yes, you're freaking me out. But we already did that, we have the charged battery and the maid should spring back to her murderous self. Hey! See, I let their systems beginning reboot. Beginning recovery from critical failure. Basic input output executing NBR unified bootloader executing kernel. Kernel executing SVININIT. Calibrating CI state with USD. Oh, that is better. Oh, you have an English-French accent, yes? Bonjour, monsieur. Ah. Uh, she is quite know. lovely. So, um, who are you? Who are you? Je m'appelle Chantel. I am Monsieur Gill and Monsieur Dakarai's maid. You're a synthetic maid? Pardon, mademoiselle, I, I do not understand. A synth? Excusez-moi. What is a synth? It certainly stays in character. I uh, help the masters with their household things. And where were you made? Mademoiselle, I was born in France. Yeah, because all French people I know run on graphene power cells. So she thinks herself to be human, which is, uh, I guess, staying in character. Mr. and Mr. Vanderwall. What can you tell me about the Vanderwalls? They are the best employers a young French girl could hope to have. Are they, um, are they really? Quite so, monsieur. So loving. And with such exquisite taste. Wow, they must have got this one customized for sycophancy. Do you know anyone who might want to hurt them? Oh no, monsieur. They are beloved by all. Then why are you covered in their blood? What do you do around here? I do the cleaning, the cooking, and the shopping. And that's it? Monsieur, it would not be proper for me to say. 
So you are a sex bot. Mon dieu! How dare you infer such a thing? Why the hell did they get a synth like this? Surely you realize, monsieur. All the best maids in the world, they are French. And the best lovers, I hear. What are you implying, mademoiselle? I never had Gilles down as quite such a... Francophile. I am also very discreet, monsieur. When you care for someone's home, there are a lot of things that you hear. Or do. Mademoiselle, such slander. And even if true, I, I would not say. I have Monsieur Gilles confidence to think of. So she is a sex bot. I'm also chewing on a lovely snack I made. It was delicious. Yum. Have you had your safety protocols removed? Monsieur? Would you be able to do anything Mr. Vanderwald told you? Anything? Anything. Monsieur, you should not ask such questions. I am just the maid. What can you remember before you ran out of power? Monsieur, I remember many things. My memory is holographic. But I have Monsieur Gale's confidence to consider. Even if Cell requires it? I cannot simply discuss what happens around here without his permission. He certainly paid for loyalty. Well, he's kind of dead, and I think you killed them, since your arms are covered in blood. What the hell happened upstairs? How do you mean, Monsieur? The room's recent redecoration. Shades of Giel everywhere. And the body of Dakari Vanderwall, shot to pieces in the tub. Any opinions on this? Oh, Monsieur, I cannot discuss this. I have been told, most strictly, not to discuss what goes on upstairs. Even if it includes the double homicide of your owner? I have my orders. What would Monsieur Gale think if I went against him? Probably not a great deal anymore. She doesn't quite seem to get what's happened. Might not have been written with a comprehension of abstracts like death. Two men have been killed upstairs. There's blood and human remains all over the room, and all over you. If you weren't directly involved, then you're at least a material witness. I am sorry, Monsieur. I cannot say what happens upstairs. Monsieur Gill, he values his privacy greatly. How about we take you down to cell and manually pull your memory apart? Regis, it's a synth. Threatening it won't help. Thanks. We'll keep looking around. My pleasure to evict, Monsieur. You haven't helped much, my dear. I think I'll call your makers again. Stepford and Sons, Liam Stepford. We believe this synth to be a material witness, or involved, in a murder. Oh my, no! How horrific! Oh my, it's yes! to cooperate with us, though. Vanderwall seems to have ordered it to remain silent about certain areas of his home. Oh my, secrecy is one of many reasons that users opt for non-OEM personalities. If you wish, I could have one of my engineers disassemble its mind state in order to recover memories. This may take several hours, depending upon the algorithm used for laying down synaptic engrams. I'm afraid time is a critical factor, Mr. Stepford. Is there any way I can do it here? Oh, there may be. Oh my, yes. I shall transfer the necessary tool. A lovely. Splitter app. Okay. Time to... Um, whoa, what does it do? What's this splitter for? CI platform mines are modular, Dr. Regis. Oh my, yes. All are made of three components, personality, role, and platform memory. The maid's desire not to tell you likely stems from her personality. So if she had a different personality... Something more helpful. She might tell us what we need to know. It may not be quite so simple, but that is the foundation of the idea, oh my yes. Where would I find other mind state modules? Any other platform that runs a communicative interface. It is not simply limited to synthetic platforms, oh my, no. So, um, we're gonna get either Sheffy or the bar dude <laughs> to replace the mate's personality, as far as I understood it. What does a personality do in a synth? The personality determines a great deal of its behavior, oh my, yes. In many cases, it's the most noticeable part of its intelligence. It governs how it may act and how it behaves in its interaction with users. This one thinks it's a French maid. Perhaps copied from the mind state of a real example of such. What does the role memory do? It alters how a platform will perceive a situation, and also acts as a source of knowledge for its job. How would it be different? Take, for example, a man in the street. A platform with the role of a sales clerk may see a customer. A law enforcement unit may see a potential suspect. 
Oh my, yes! And the role will furnish it with instructions on how to handle it. What is a platform memory component? These are the memories that each individual unit has recorded. At simplest, it is often a holographic matrix in which engrams are laid down. Sight, sound, and any other senses available are stored in here. Oh my, yes. Based on its role and personality, a unit may have a different understanding of these memories. So, it'd perceive it differently depending on how the rest of its mind was built? Oh my, yes. Oh my. That's enough. That's all I need to know for now. Please don't hesitate to get in contact if you think we can help. Oh my, stop. Splitter. Can I use it on her as she is? Because I get the feeling that I can choose between these other two personalities. Okay. The role of maid. Memory of maid. Can I access it? Okay. So I can't do much. I just have to combine the three to get the right combination so she'll be able to tell me. 